What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, the Aussie Cobra. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, pre turn notification. So, anyway, um, this is Power Book 2 Ghost, Season 1, Episode 1 The Strangers. So, so much, so far, when I first watched it, I liked it. It was good where it was, because, you know, we started off with two weeks where he was run running late to college, and he was late. They decided to give him another chance to do, you know, to do the work because they didn't give him a chance he was going to be out. And thanks to, um, I think her name was Lauren. That's where he met first. We're going to see him and Lauren more often. And yes, him and Lauren was at the diner. They was talking. She went to the restaurant. That's where Cooper sat, sold up. I'm not going around the store because I don't do it by order. And of course, he, um, remember to read and Cooper sat made a deal because you know he saw him at the, the truth that night. And we already know the uh, another attorney think that Tasha killed James. When we already know that it wasn't Tasha, it was Tariq that killed Ghost. You know, A.K.A. James St. Patrick. So, and now we know that attorney. I forgot his name because I still don't know his name yet. We already know that he going well. Tamika was representing Tasha, which I was surprised that she did. But she represented her at first and tried to get her to make a pre deal. That she can be on pro on a um house arrest, so she won't have to go to the prison. And that cop, boy, that cop was really, really feisty, saying that she'll be seeing you again. That's exactly what she told her. And boy, was she's laughing. And when she tell about the sad story, you could tell she didn't want to hear it. That's the facts to what she said. So, so far. I enjoyed this episode of Power Book 2 Ghosts. I enjoyed it so much. And then we seen Tui's old roommate that he's already on the show. I forgot his name, but he's on there. He was at the strip club saying that he would give out a credit card. Those women, you can't, you can't just give it to them. You got to give them cash. I'm surprised she didn't, like, dismiss him. I thought that's what she wanted to do because she was in the strip club. To we they how old are they? Cause I know they're not grown. Then we seen the girl that to we that the girl we seen a girl that she liked to read. But the reason why she did what she did, she said it wasn't personal, it was business. So she did what she had to do. She also apologized for what she done. I forgot her name, cause I I just didn't expect to see her in this episode because his room, his friend knew her numbers there, and I don't know if we're gonna see her again because we already saw her hair. She got, she is gorgeous. Her hair, she got a pigtail, ponytail down to here. I think that's her real hair. They long now. Last time she had afro, so now, then we know that Tariq still gonna get Tasha out no matter what he gotta do. He gonna have to um pay his pay the um the lawyer more money. 500 k at first, then he got to pay 40000 or something like that, whatever he said. So, if he want to get Tasha out, he going to have to make, Tariq going to have to hustle. And we already know he want to get his mother out. And I think, well, she gets out, it might be by the end of the season. We already know they're going to get a break. I believe it's going to be 10 episodes because I checked it for myself. So, until they do season 2, which they will, I heard they're going to do season 2. So, I'll be looking forward to the show. Now, I know my dog already doing a review and doing this on live, so I will be watching him soon, sometime today or tomorrow because I know I'm going to be behind, which I am now. So, we did see the we did see um, Monet and we see the rest of his her family. We see his her daughter because we already know that to we in, you know, remember, he already introduced to we. And they, that's going to be his roommate, and he's going to be tutoring him. But I feel like he's going to do his work for him so he can start playing. Because we know he's a ball, ball basketball player. And we know Kane knocked the guy out. Because you remember Kane was getting some head by the girl, by this, this, excuse me, this man's girlfriend. But then we find out that she didn't want to go back with him. So whatever happened, that's why she wants to stay, because she loved it. He could just walked away, and he would never got shot. Cause she, you know, Monique was wanting him to go home. Cause she didn't want to hurt him. She didn't want him to get killed. But he gonna keep coming back, and we already know that Monique even told 
um, Mo, um, Zeke that he could defend himself because Zeke was trying to break out the fight, and pretty much you know that's you know the cousin, and we already know she's gonna try to keep the rest of them out of trouble because you don't want and not like that. We know things are gonna get really crazy. We know Tariq's gonna screw up. We know Cooper Sack gonna screw up with his brother. His little brother even mess gonna even say that he was gonna screw up, and I can see what's gonna happen. I can see that happening. Then Tamika was pissed off because you know Tasha fired her because she refused to tell the truth who shot James because she know it wasn't her. Everybody know it was her, and I guess Tasha gonna have a hard time getting out because we know it's gonna be tough. I'm surprised the women ain't trying to fight her or anything, but that might happen. And she's going to have to defend herself. And pretty much, they think that Ghost killed Keisha Wiz wasn't. And then, we did see Tommy's name come out. And Tasha said Tommy Egan killed James. And even the attorney didn't believe that. And we don't believe it. But, you know, this is the only way to get her out. But it didn't work because... You remember those two, John, we did see John this episode. I forgot the other guy's name that was Ghost Partners. Also made more, um, Cooper to do what he had to do, make us proud. And of course, the attorney read it, and then Cooper sat read her right. He said, you're going to arrest for the mother of Jane St. Patrick. And that's what the police officer was laughing at her when, they, when she was taking her back to prison. So she won't be getting out for a little while. And I think... Long, even long, and Tariq gonna hook up, or Tariq gonna be hooking up with Monet's daughter. Cause it's gonna be a little triangle. Now that the other girl is out of the picture, I don't think we're gonna see her again. Jasmine got so big though, guys, and we know that his mother, his grandmother, tried to get him out of trouble. One hand is the film. You see how he snapped at her, but I still she she understand why he snapped, cause he's grieving. Even he probably pretend to put on the act. That he pretend to grief, but we know he, he gonna have, he gonna be gonna do something, and we already know that. Mo, next episode, I think Tui and Monet is gonna meet, and he gonna wanna work for her so he can make that money. I know he gonna screw it up, but I know Tui is gonna find a way to fix this, cause he did that on the original. So I'm gonna good luck to Tui, even I ban him, but good luck to him, and I'll do what's bad the guy doing what he had to do. And, you know, for all of him to get another chance, they decided to let him stay. So he could be in college, so he could help his roommate to get, um, get him to play. Because he can't, like, because you know, um, I forgot um, the guy's name, the old guy. Can you remember he was going to get tossed to the 